Hello, and welcome back to a series that has been long needed to be finished. I didn't think about this. Hopefully this won't take too long. You run around and I run around and we all know the game runs around. Okay, give it a sec, give it a sec. There we go, it's a day! It shows going until three. Woo! Chapter two! <laughs> oh, I've got so much I gotta do! Ah! Just finished Daybreak not too long ago. I've been playing Sparking Zero for a bit. Uh, wonderful game, by the way. Totally recommend playing it. Um, so yeah, we're just gonna go right into it. We're gonna, the others were checking for security reasons after they were found led to the Gover Governor General's office. Pardon us, Governor General. Ah, yes. Do come in. <laughs> it's good to see you again. Excuse us. Is it? I figured you'd have some words for this man. Yes, it's yes, nice it's to nice see you both see again, you too. too. Ah, Rufus. Though I think it's my first time meeting the other two. I am the Governor General of the Province of Crossbell, Rufus Alberea. It's a pleasure to meet the new Class 7 of Thor's branch campus. Yeah, I've been playing uh, Trails of Gold Steel 1 on like my ridiculously high difficulty, and uh, we just got to Borea Hard. So. <laughs> it's been some time since I last saw you, but I can tell at a glance how different you look. You've oh. definitely gotten yeah, got taller, taller, but more importantly, you've really matured. Thank you. Though I'd have to say Yusus has changed even more than me. Yes, so I hear. Speaking of, you seem to have changed as well. Black Rabbit. And you haven't changed at all, Governor General. My height is approximately the same as it's always been. Ellie. So tactless. <laughs> Granted, your blunt manner of speaking hasn't changed. It seems you have some good friends now, though. It's an honor to meet you, Your Excellency. I am Kurt Vander, the second child of the Vander House. Ah, yes. Your father has helped me out a number of times in the past. It's unfortunate you didn't join the main campus, but I'm sure there are valuable opportunities to be had at the branch campus as well. Thank you. And you are... Una Crawford. Originally from the Crossbell Military Police Academy. I transferred to Thor's branch campus. <laughs> oh, I've heard about you. You're acquainted with First Lieutenant Orlando and Second Lieutenant Seeker, correct? Further, Major Revelt was the one who recommended you to the Academy. I'm sure you've gone through much lately, but I think you'll find your new school to be a good match for you. I believe it is a good blend of the perspectives of both Erebonia and Crossbell. Yes, I'll do my best. All right, then I'll make my report now. Very well, I pray to aiding her, she'll find success. I'm sure you're already aware, but an inspection team will be visiting from the Imperial mainland. Despite the fact that we've raised our security level to maximum, I yet have my concerns. The society has been active and a cryptid has suddenly appeared. Oh, is that part of our task? Outside of the normal request, we can also read an additional document labeled Crucial Investigation Report. Investigate the reports of cryptid sightings in the Crossbow Province. Is that... What's a cryptid? I feel like I've heard the term before. You would! Cryptids are extremely powerful monsters with mysterious powers. During the Civil War, a number of them appeared around the Empire. But they're showing up in Crossbow now? Indeed. It seems one was spotted the other day along the mountain path to the north. But until this isn't the first time we've appeared in Crossbow, have you perhaps heard... Chance heard about them before you? Yes, I didn't know they showed up in the Empire too, but I heard a few of them appeared around the Declaration of Independence a year and a half ago. D 
given their actions in Sutherland, they should most likely be our top suspects. Oh yeah, Parm was the first village. Opposite of Kelvin. Hold up. And no, 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 they didn't go to Crossbow in the first game. Uh, even Group B didn't go to Crossbow. But, you know, I like that it's basically the opposite of where Group B, where Group B went in the first game is where we're going in this one, Sans Crossbell. Do we investigate the cryptid on the mountain path as well? No, that one has already been defeated. What if we investigate other areas where they were seen? Already defeated? Was that an Imperial Army store? No, a certain wanted fugitive took care of it. Ah. A wanted fugitive? Instructor Rain, yeah. However, it wouldn't do good to relying on a wanted man to clean things up for us. Therefore, I expect good news from all of you regarding this task. And with that, I bid you all good luck. Ash and Chevalier and members of the new Class 7. Understood. Uh, yep. Let's do it. Oh, before you go, a small bit of news from Lecter. It seems there's a possibility of the Society's which is here in Crossbow. Society's witch. You mean Vita? They traced the radio recordings back to somewhere in Crossbow. Yeah, it's Vita. <laughs> You'll have to give me a, a, some cre some uh, slack here. It has been I have played this one and four the least. Effectively, now nah, I've played four the least. I played one and two the most. So some of this is gonna be like I don't remember this. Also, it seems you've been in contact with Lucis recently. Yeah, mostly through letters and old messages. We haven't seen each other in a while since we've each been so busy. I see. Hmm. Have you not talked with him since? I haven't. We can speak about my younger brother when the opportunity presents itself. I'm sure we'll have much more to discuss besides just him. Yeah, yeah, no. Remember that? Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. Understood when the opportunity presents itself. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah, no, yeah, no, that, that's that's fair. <laughs> I mean, you find out that Osborne is his dad. What are you talking to Governor, Governor General Rufus about? Is it about Yusuf Abare? Yeah, more or less. Yusuf, he's the Governor General's younger brother, right? He's the acting head of the Alberia Dukedom, which oversees the cruising province. He's also a member of the old Class 7. I see. Jeez, is everyone from old Class 7 <laughs> such a, some mega hotshot? Even the Elia guy is the son of some big league in the Imperial Army, right? <laughs> I guess so. Though so we may not measure up to the allies that Fugitive has. Though so we may not measure up to the allies that Fugitive has something. That's... I've been wondering. You seem to have an idea of who this fugitive could be. <laughs> but of course. He's the true hero of Crossbell. Heck yeah, he is. He beat down an evil cult and arrested the dictator mayor. Excuse me? Before the annexation, the Crossbell Police Department had a division called the Special Support Section. The man we're talking about was its leader. He and the other members overcame so much together. And now, he's a fugitive in his own home. Lloyd Bannings. Instructor Randy was a member of the SSS too, actually. <sighs> Instructor Randolph worked alongside someone like that? So, if this man is a fugitive, what has he done? Did he resort to terrorism in an attempt to free Crossbow? Don't even joke about that! He's not. He's just asking I mean, a question. I mean, sure. He's in hiding now. But he's just trying to help Crossbell get its freedom back. Not to mention, he's helping people in trouble and hunting down cryptids. There's absolutely no way someone like him is a criminal. He and his friends are the ones in the right. Uh, he certainly seemed like a just person. Yeah, he couldn't be further from the dangerous fugitive they painted him as. Wait, you both know him? Yeah, we fought him back before he was branded a fugitive. Remember that? 
<laughs> Each one of us refused to back down, but in the end, he came out on top. The weight of what he was shouldering, his fall was steam work. I told him it was a tie at the time, but looking back, there's no question I lost. Well, I beg to differ. <laughs> you get it, instructor. There's no doubt he and the rest of the SSS are Crossbow's true heroes. Way more than a certain Chevalier I can name. Mm -hmm. But that doesn't change the fact he's a criminal. <laughs> like I said, I don't see I didn't see him as a criminal at all. Though the governor general certainly seems to. I know you don't want to hear this, but don't even think about what's going to help him out, okay? I know that even Randy's holding himself back. So I'll give these special operations missions my all. Since Randy isn't allowed to go anywhere, I'll help lessen Lloyd's burden for him. You know, you're certainly energetic all of a sudden. But that's strange. Lloyd Bannings. I heard he's on the run with that girl. Even if he gets help from the Divine Blade of Winter, you... I don't know how long do they keep rolling this. I think Arios could step to them. Like, I don't know for sure, but he's certainly tough. Nothing else. And Yin is apparently freaking strong. Considering her appearance in Daybreak. That's all I'm going to say. Because if you're watching this before you're watching Daybreak, which is the smart thing to do. Well, well, man's fancy meeting you here, Reen. Hey! Huh? Oh. Machias! Everyone makes an appearance today. <laughs> Machias! <laughs> it's good to see you. Did you just get here? Oh, no. I arrived yesterday and came here first thing this morning. My inspection work starts today, just like your field exercises. My fellow inspectors and I need to go greet the Governor General. Ah, I see. We just got back from meeting with him, actually. Good luck. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm ready for him. Uh -huh. Hey, um, is he... Yes, he's also a member of Old Class 7, as well as the son of the Imperial Governor. <laughs> yeah, dude. Just everyone in Class 7 has some noble lineage. Governor Regnant's son? I don't know who that is, but he sure sounds like a big deal. Oh, you're that Black Rabbit girl. I'd heard you'd enrolled on the branch campus, but you've sure changed. Nice to meet you two as well. I'm Machias Regnitz. I'm here in Crossbell for the Governor Government Accountability Inspector. Inspectory. That's quite a mouthful. It's an organization that keeps check on the various government agencies from a judicial standpoint. Is that so? It sounds like you chose the hard mode at the worst time. Allie, come on. It was usual. <laughs> and no, she's absolutely right. We're in charge of making sure there's no wrongdoing in all government agencies, including the Imperial Government and the Governor General. Sheesh. It seems hard mode was an understatement. Yeah. It's the one he chooses all the same. Or the one he chose all the same. Seems like you're doing well, all things considered. Yeah, it feels a bit like the walls are closing in. But it's the same for everyone these days, right? Yeah, pretty much. Heck yeah. Machias! We're clear to visit now! Oh, Reiner. I'm introducing this is my classmate, Reen, and these are students. Oh man, for real? I've heard so much about you from Machias. <laughs> I'm flattered. We shouldn't keep the Governor General waiting. G Governor General, not gentlemen. You here for the field exercises? I'm sure it'll be tough, but give it everything you got. I give you a call tonight, Reen. Good luck to you all. Yeah. See you later, Machias. You too, Reiner. Farewell. Good luck.
he, he's young, but he seems quite capable. I mean, he's much more grounded than his superior. Well, the inspector is full of talented people, so I'm sure his superior is good, too. But he seems a little inexperienced to be taking on the imperial government. Or the government generally. That government, I can't do words. Our class 7 predecessors all seem to be really challenging themselves, huh? I don't know how to say this, but I'm starting to feel really motivated. I couldn't sound as enthusiastic as I wanted to, but I agree. So we should get started with our special operations missions? Oh, right. Let's check out the request document one more time. Alright, so what are our tasks? Alright, so we have... Uh, Epstein tech support. <coughs> Great Crossbell Bake Off on West Street. Okay. And so as the Governor General of Naples, they seem reasonable. If you use the Governor General of Crossbell. Uh -huh. Southern Crossbell City, Lake Elm, and Ursula Intersection. Off Crossbow Highway, the swampy lake area, I hit up the boat shack, please investigate both points. Alright, I guess we're gonna check the other two areas of quick that's over here. Alright, let's do it! West Street, oh you're right! Uh, it's nothing. How about we start at the harbor first? Then we can take East Street, go through Central, and finish up on West Street. That's what I recommend. No, I want to do it my way. Okay. You can't tell me what to do. I do things my own way. Thank God, and I guess I got no choice. Yeah, I guess. I'm gonna go to West Street first, though. I've learned to always do the optional stuff first. That makes the most sense. This is the North Seathern Harbor. That lake over there is Lake Elm. The view from the park is breathtaking. This area has many modern buildings. Yes, there's also serves as the business district. Many companies have offices here. Hmm. One of the biggest buildings is the RF Group. The largest manufacturer in the Empire. Didn't you receive a mandatory request from them? We should head there before we go to the other districts. Hello? That's... Yeah, that's the uh, Michelin cruise ship. I think it's preparing for the first trip of the day. It's intriguing. Maybe we should go check it out. And let us begin our control. Patrol. Alright, so I... In other words... Ah, jeez! Where are you going? Get back here! <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. Like, I've been playing Daybreak so much, and you can't talk to every citizen in Daybreak. So, like, I'm getting used to stuff again. What is this? 
Oh, it's the, uh... This building is... Looks like an old office building. It appears to be long. Seems like someone's inside. This building, could it be? Ah, it must be the SSS building. That makes sense. I don't remember for sure. But, uh, probably. Anyway. Hey. Hey. Pause, I finished the thing you asked me. Bustling, considering how early in the morning it is. Sure is. Let's get the boats here to take you straight to Michelin. It's a rather famous theme park, viewable from the field exercise camp. I believe its full name is Michelin Wonderland. Yep. Its mascot Mishi is super popular with kids and adults alike. Tourism has been on the decline, but since the annexation, there have been tons of visitors from Erebonia. See, I've never been to a theme park before. They were closed last year, so I didn't have any first-hand experience. In here. Since we're already here, it'd be a shame not to check it out at least once. Huh? Is that a soldier? It seems they're checking people as they disembark. That's the crossbow military police, right? Yeah, but what are they looking for? It appears the early military police is here as well. But still, why? I think the people being searched are the ones who stayed at the resort, ho the resort hotel. Hmm. Increasing your security because of the inspection team is coming. If I remember correctly, there's a railway that goes directly to Michigan through the medical college. In which case, it's not unusual for the RMP to be involved. But it's strange that they're only checking the guests who are returning. <clears throat> Either way, I guess we won't have the luxury of going to Michelin Michelin ourselves. But you know what I can do! This spot seems excellent for fish. You better believe it, Doug! There. Got a bite! I remember... Oh! This is promising! I'm a failure as a fisherman. Well, it's not bad. There. there. Got a bite. This is promising. It's a whopper. Okay. Right, now I gotta go to the RF building. Which is this one? Looking up at this, it is really quite tall. It's not quite as tall as the tower, however. This building was originally used by a well-known bank. The International Bank of Crossville, the largest bank on the continent, once run by the former President Croyce. Yes, right before the Declaration of Independence, there was a bombing here. Since then, the building was vacated. On a side note, the repairs to the building were finished last fall. The ABC is downsized, but they should still be tenants in the building. As well as the Epstein Foundation, he made the request. I want my open world trails game! Dad, come on. Hey. Good morning. Oh, you're not an employee. Where 
said, all right, then what can I help you with today? Ah, then you must be, I was told you were coming. Unfortunately, the Epstein Foundation branch isn't quite open, or isn't open quite this early. Can't trip it down, what should we do? It would be a waste of time to simply wait here. That'd be a big help, thanks. Here, I'll write down my number for you. Seems to investigate the entire harbor area now. Maybe you may need a postponed quest from the Foundation. Wait, don't you sell something? I feel like you do. I don't remember if you do. I think you do. Yeah, you do. Uh, it feels good to be back. I gotta finish three and four. And then hop on the train to Azure. Oh, I might go to Azure before I uh, play four. I don't, I don't know. I also gotta play... Uh, Freaking, not Azure, Zero and Azure, and then I gotta play phone call. That's a spam number, I don't know who that is. <laughs> My guy's in a hurry. <laughs> Oh, hey, anyway, never mind. I thought it was the SSS building. I'm a goof. Crossbell. Surprise, we're just one block over and the cityscape is so different. This is the more eastern this is more of an eastern style district. Crossbell is known for being a melting pot of different cultures. You don't see this in Arabonia, do you? Yes, this is truly a trade city on <laughs> the greatest trade city on the continent. Over there, is that the Bracer Guild building? Hmm, so it is. The prestigious A-Ring Bracer, the Defiant Blade of Wind, was affiliated with this branch. Unfortunately, I heard it's currently closed for the time being. Signs are still up. Yes, but there are reasons for that. We don't have any quests nearby, so there isn't any place here we need to visit, but there's a lot of tasty restaurants around here, so maybe we should take a stroll. Better believe it! Hello, Ronald! Well, formality on the country, the Empire is now the exception. <laughs> My friend Sunita is a year younger than me, but she already knows what she wants to do when she grows up. What should I do? Whatever you want, bro. And your brother Azo got a job at a big trading company. Hmm. <laughs> Pardon me, I'm just wandering into your house. This person looks familiar. That's right, we helped them in Heimdall that one time. Oh, is something on? <laughs> it's nothing. Wait. Who? Wait. 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 That must have been referring to one of the first two games. I don't remember this dude. I mean, here's the thing. I vaguely remember this dude.
I don't know. His name sounds familiar, like I made a joke about James Bond, but anyway. I'm grateful that you're helping out with the shopping and all of my stead, but don't go anywhere dangerous and don't blow any strangers around, you hear me? Okay, it's... Aww. Here's up, buddy. What you selling? About it. Martial arts, Mishy! For the win! Sure, but what are you gonna do? You make it too easily, Swain. <laughs> because they just don't want to charge of her budget. Oh, it's a thing to run over. What should we do? You're both too easily, Swain. Crossville branch of the Bracer Guild closed last fall. Yeah, I heard it was the Governor General's decision. But the building is still owned by the Guild, and Bracer still stop by there. You see, they're treated differently from the Guild in the capital. Well, technically, the Guild is an international organization. In that sense, there are political considerations behind their treatment. You're sure not all right, Intelligence Division. Oh, yes. My apologies. No need to apologize. Honestly, it's kind of impressive. Anyway, I wonder how the receptionist is doing. He's a really fun person. He's got dreadlocks and has a really flamboyant style. Oh, I know him. Sounds like quite the character. <laughs> you can't hmm? deny. That's sign. Hmm? What sign? Dried salmon! You're probably wondering why I'm buying all of these random things. You'll see. Ah, that sign. Gotcha. It's got machine guns and bazookas? The mix of the high quality explosive is an Arcus 2 without serial number. You see that random pieces of jewelry and shit to do? Does this place have any relation to Jigger Shop? It does, and so it happens. This is their main store. Is that one of the owner? That's probably Jingo's mother. How do you get to introduce yourselves? Yo. 6 cases and 30 caliber AP over here. I saw the pain to take inventory in a warehouse this small. Doesn't have to do with this crap, but they had to close all the undesirables out in the downtown district. Hmm? Some customers? It's not often I see a celebrity in my shop. Working hard, Ash and Chevalier. You know who I am? You must know why we're here, huh? Yeah, I've heard it all from my daughter. We're from Thor's Branch Campus. She promised you were good customers who wouldn't be shy about black market products. She doesn't go out praise that good on the regular. She's usually reserved for the Acre Core. Is that information not entirely especially sensitive? I knew you were a broker, but I didn't know you were a broker. How's the shop even allowed to be here? Almighty eight years, I suppose you have to be born with common sense. My name is known throughout the industry as the one who does business with militaries across the continent and with the Aegis Corps alike. They want something? I have it. It isn't hard for me to do as I please. Trade with the East here. It's blocked on paper, but that will sound like from going through a third country. I've heard some companies even thrive when their customers so new. It's a bit unnerving how expensive the black market is. That's what happens when the government turns a blind eye. I'm curious about which company she means exactly. Hey, well, it was back when Crossbow was still in state. Anyways, you guys are gonna buy some more? I'll have you 
Heard you didn't do business in this car. I'll catch you in a fair deal. I need another salmon. I'll be right back. I need another salmon. Give me food. You don't have salmon. Which one do you have salmon? Is it you? No, it's not you. It was one of you. It's not you. It has to be you. You're the only one who could. Where did I buy it? Is it in the harbor? Ah, oh, these load times. <laughs> and it's not super long, but like... Where the frick is the salmon? Ah, uh, it doesn't tell me if it's a shop! I just have to know! I think you got noodles. I don't think you have a... Where the frick did I buy it? <laughs> I don't remember! <coughs> Wasn't for the guild, was it? I don't... it... couldn't have been. No, it's not the apartments. Where the freak did I buy that salmon? Can I only buy one? Wait. It was you. <laughs> I'm over here having a mental... I'm over here just like, where the freak did I get it? Alright. Damn it! Let's see. I need a lemon pecky. I'm awakening. Okay. How much you got to order, my guy? Ooh, nice. I'm providing our customers with quality products. That's the real beauty of business. Welcome to PNR General Store. Puck and Ruse. Yeah, thank you, thank you. Uh, I have to do it from here. There we go. Hey. Be tasty depending how you how you cook it. Ah, the fisherman guild. This is the it's the fisherman's guild. The name is pretty self-explanatory. It's pretty popular. They even have tournaments periodically. I see. So they're a little different from the imperial fishing club. I heard the owner of 
Kind of see why now. Yes, yeah, so I'm looking for a good place to set up local geography. To survey the local geography. Well, that's a strange thing to go around looking for. I might be able to help you actually. Or well, I know someone who can. I can introduce you to him. It is! Okay, so I already have you. Alright, so I already have. I already have all that. Selfish! I'm just curious, can I go this way? We should stay in the city! <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen. Alright, now we'll go to Central, Central District, I guess. Since we've already kind of checked out everything here. And then we'll call that at the episode. Just wait till we go to the entertainment district and start gambling. Ah, uh, this is where the uh, SSS office is. The back of the Central Square. There's just way more people here than earlier. Well, this is the heart of Crossfell City. It has everything from apartment stores to mobile shop stores to weapon shops. We're gonna investigate the crypt so we can upgrade our equipment here. And so many people on the street might be able to listen to rumors and gather information. It might be hard since this place is so huge, but we should be around the whole area. Yeah, no, yeah. Hey! Yeah, I understand that we have been in the best of my life. Hey! Juno, you know, what are you doing here? Oh, so the military school that came from the Empire was. Yes, Thor's Military Academy's branch campus. The school I transferred to. I see, I'm sure there's a lot going on, but welcome home. It looks like Major Rizal pulled a few strings for you. Let me introduce you. See, so the Astrid from Savalia is your instructor. Nice to meet you. I'm Captain Cade from the Crossbow Military Police Secretary Division. It's an honor to work with a famous hero. Thanks for the news, you be so formal. This is all part of our field exercises. I'm just an instructor, so feel free to treat me the same as you would anybody else. Hmm. That wasn't a good time, sorry. I see, I understand. I'll be waiting here, so when you get done, please come talk to me. Ah! Oh, never mind. I thought you were someone else. Sorry, I'm waiting for my friend to return. The bell. The bell. I know I saw it earlier, but it really is quite imposing up close. It's at least five arch tall. In the database, it says it is Bell of Crossbell. It's said that it created by some big shop in the Middle Ages. That's what inspired the name Crossbell. Ta-da! And that's why it's a symbol of the city. It's like we have our very own personal tour guide with us. There's so many I heard once it. There are three girls in total. Hmm. Are there? You got a problem? Ah, members of Thor's French campus, welcome. Your reputation precedes you. I'm sure you've heard many conflicting reports. Don't worry, order has been restored. Hmm. 
Yeah, I heard it's a huge monster. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, oh, we got a, we got a rumor, we got a rumor. Cafe, this is the place for me. I'll try it. <laughs> Our motto is beautiful food for a reasonable price. Why would I eat your food? No, I'm just kidding. Times department store! Several times! I know I'm not talking to every NPC, you have to forgive me. Mm -hmm. Welcome to the third. Wait, huh? I thought I recognized your stupid butt. Been a while, Ash and some folly, eh? Uh, do you know the stuff you're gonna do? Pattery? You think you got you could think you forget the people who got you there. Better not forget this face again. It might be the last thing you see before you wake up in a hospital. Never imagine it burning in your crossbow. You're working in an apartment store no less. You seem to have taken it pretty well too. How was that? I was sending out my resume, but I messed up from writing the address and ended up working here. <laughs> Mind you, taking time to say hello to you. It's the fucking language. That's fine. Fur bish. Ah, here look. Eighty years, you want. Uh, no, no, I mean, welcome to our home store. Selection is modest, but I hope you find what you're looking for. Orca floaty! I don't have enough money! I don't have enough money! I need more money! Racer Mishy! Man, you're selling yourself short. You said you got a model selection? You got, like, pretty good. <laughs> Alright, so... There you go. <laughs> With this, I'll be able to switch from the water. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> so embarrassed. Right, um... Hello, there. welcome to the Strega store. Yeah, sorry buddy, I ain't got the money for your shop. As much as I want to. These are... These bell of crossbow replicas make for great souvenirs. Don't be afraid to pick one up. Ho 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 ho! Hmm... Now these would actually be good to have. Um... What about you? I wonder how many of these citizens are actually the same in the crossbow games. Ah, oh, man. Ooh. Mm. Uniform. That's by the sage, isn't it? Who did answer that? I can tell. Stereotypes by local and international brands. Oh, what can I sell? Alright. I want to sell my DLC. <laughs> ah, it's still not enough. I'm just shy. All right, hold on. We can we can do this. We can do this. All right.
There we go. <laughs> Alright. And... Oh man, I almost maxed out Laura. Heck yeah! I love my uh, noble woman. She's a cool character. All right, that's enough. I now have more money than I know what to do with. I should have enough time to check this out real quick. Yeah, I got time for this. You play Vantage? Welcome home, Yuna. Looks like we know each other. Let me see the call for the garbage on the top you can make adjustments to your artist use, so just let me know. I never thought you'd make a return like this, you know. You never know what connections can lead to. Just focus on your exercise. If you get hurt, I'm never gonna shake at the end of it. Are you familiar with Vantage Masters? If you don't mind, I'd love to play against you when you have the time. Heck yeah! Better believe I will! Orbital Dryer, yeah! Mechanic Michi! I'm gonna get all the Michi merchandise! <laughs> what do you mean you can't give it now? Are you embarrassed? Wait, hold on, why not? Tell me why. Why? Man, you're a coward. <laughs> Alright, actually, um, never mind me. Can I sell any of this stuff? I mean, this thing, I don't need it. Oh, so I can't sell that. Of course, I wouldn't like to sell that. I like that I can't sell these. The, these are unsellable. What about some mature cheese? Um. Let's see. How many Mishis do I have? A Marshall Mishi. A Bracer Mishi. A Mechanic Mishi. I gotta have all the Mishis. All the Mishies! Alright. We're gonna stop here. I'm assuming this is where I left off. Considering the safe house says 421, that's about right. I think. I don't freaking remember. Ugh. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you. I will. Let's see. I might be able to win pretty quickly. <laughs> I won't lose. Oh, better believe you will. Oh well. Let's get hand. I don't like Ranger. Ranger can attack from a distance, I think. Yeah, I don't like that. Hey! How about you don't do that?
Excuse me? Yeah, no, we're gonna we're gonna buff the holy heck out of you. <laughs> yeah! There we go. Nice, I'm so lucky. Are you? Oh. Interesting. Oh man, I get a second attack. Heck yeah! And that's game, son. You win this time. Better believe it. All right. Woo! Look at me. I'm the prince. All right. Thank y'all for watching. I will see you all in the next video of whatever I decide to do. It might not be trails, might be trails. I don't know. We'll see. Adios. Bye.